Hi guys, welcome to Royal Lobos. It's my pleasure to have you here and I really hope that you all are doing well. In today's tutorial, we will draw a letter logo design for a brand, Top Ups. The logo will be a combination of two alphabets, T and U. Now let's start with the design process in Inkscape. So first of all, we will set the document properties. So go to File, select the document properties and select the display owners to pixels and custom units to also pixels. Change the width to 1280 and height to 720 pixels like this. And now select zoom to fit to page like this. Now select the pen tool and draw a vertical line while holding down the control key like this. Now set the height of the line to say 90 pixels and then go into fill and stroke menu and in stroke style Select the stroke width to 3 pixels like this. Now the line seems better. Now select the pen tool and draw a horizontal line while holding down the control key like this. Set the, width, set the width of the line to 360 pixels and set the stroke width to 3 pixels like this. Now we want to place this line at the edge of this line. So first of all we will go to the snapping tool, turn it on and then turn on the rectangle snap like this and place it at this end. Now right click, duplicate it and place it at this end. Now again select the pen tool and draw a vertical line while holding down the control key and set the height of the line to 45 pixels and width to 3 pixels like this. Now place this line at the edge of this intersection like this. Now again select this horizontal line right click duplicate it and place it at this end like this now select all of these lines and drag it here now select these vertical lines and press delete on the keyboard to delete them now select all of these three lines right click duplicate it and drag it horizontally while holding down the control key like this again right click duplicate it and drag it horizontally while holding down the control key. Again right click and duplicate it and drag it horizontally like this. Now delete this bottom line by selecting with the left click of mouse and pressing delete on the keyboard. Now select the circle tool and turn on this snap to paths. And draw a circle from this point to this path. We only need the stroke and doesn't need the fill so we will delete the fill by clicking on this cross icon like this. Again we will draw a circle from this corner to this path and from this corner to this path and again from this corner to this path. Now select this line and also this line while holding down the shift key and right click, duplicate it, go to path select combine and rotate these lines at 90 degrees like this. Now turn on the quadrant snap like this and place these lines at the quadrant of this circle like this. Now drag this line up to this path and up to this path. Now right click duplicate it and place this line at the quadrant of this circle and drag it up to this path and also up to this path. Now again select the pen tool and draw a line from this quadrant to this corner and change the stroke width of the line to 3 pixels like this and drag the line up to this point. Now again select the pen tool and draw a line from this corner to this corner and change the stroke width of the line to say 3 pixels like this. Now again select the circle tool and draw a circle. First turn on this intersection point and draw a circle from this intersection point to this intersection point and again draw a second circle from this intersection point to this intersection point and then draw a third circle from this intersection point to this intersection point. Now we are almost done with our logo. Now it's time to give it some final touch so select all of the objects go to path and select combine. Now select the rectangle tool and draw a rectangle in such a way that it covers the whole body like this and give it some solid color like this red color and place the solid body below our main object 
like this. Now select both of these objects, go to path and select division. Now you can delete the unwanted parts by selecting the part with the left click of mouse and pressing delete on the keyboard like this. Now we will delete all the unwanted parts by selecting and pressing delete on the keyboard like this. Now this is our final letter logo with the combination of two alphabets T and U. Now select all of these parts, go to path and select union. Now we doesn't need the stroke so we will cancel it by clicking on this cross icon while holding down the shift key like this. Now we will reduce the dimensions by dragging this point with the help of left click of mouse while holding down the control key like this. Now select the text tool and write the name of the brand like top ups select this and change the font to say tw sent empty and select the dimensions to bold like this now reduce the dimension of the text by dragging this point with the left click of mouse while holding down the control key like this sorry again select zoom to fit to page and like this i think it's better and drag it to this point now now go to path and select object to path and right click and select ungroup like this now this is our final logo now it's time to give it some colors which i have already decided you can easily see the colors from the color codes now select our logo and select the dropper tool and give it this color now select this ups Again select the dropper and give it this color. Now select the top and select dropper and give it this color. Now this is our final lateral logo design. Now if you think that this video helps you in some way then please like and subscribe the channel. And also suggest me in the comment section that how this design can be improved. And also share your thoughts that whether you like it or not. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.